Hey everyone, magandang araw sa inyo lahat. Today we're going to take a look at the Quick Mask tool in Photoshop. It's an amazing tool to use in architectural visualization. Check out this video, we're starting right away. To create a quick mask, click on this button or press Q on the keyboard. In the layers panel, the background layer color becomes red to indicate that we're now in quick mask mode. Click on the brush tool or press B on keyboard and select this grass foreground. Now let's edit in standard mode. Again, click this button or press Q to exit from quick mask mode. The red overlay becomes a selection. Let's apply a levels adjustment layer. And I'll just drag this handle to the left to affect some adjustments within the selection. The default blending mode of our adjustment layer is set to normal. To change this blending mode, just click this drop down arrow. And here are several blending mode options to select. Let's select the color burn blending mode. Obviously, this is not a good enhancement, but we can still adjust by lowering the opacity. And the uh, fill. Now this button controls the visibility of the adjustment layers. Click this button to compare it with the original image. Now this is with the adjustment layer and this is our original image. Again, let's press Q to edit in quick mask mode. Using the gradient tool as a quick mask, press G on the keyboard and let's create a gradient path. Press Q to exit quick mask mode and we have created a selection. Using the adjustment layer, let's select this one, black and white. Let's select a preset and go for the high contrast blue filter. And now we can see a gradual blend between a black and white image and a colored one using the quick mask mode now i'll show you how this is done it's not something that you would use in an architectural visualization but maybe in some graphic design presentations or projects we are going to use this image it's the very tropical boracay island in aklan philippines and we are going to place a text here that says Boracay. Let's edit in quick mask mode. Again, press Q on the keyboards. Let's click on the text button and select horizontal type tool. I already have our font size pre-adjusted to 200 points. Let's type Boracay. Click this one to accept the text that we have just typed. Let's go to the Move tool and drag this upwards. Let's zoom.
we are going to transform this text so that it fits the image Control T press shift and just drag this to the right then the move tool Control T again press shift and drag this to the left press shift drag this down and this one because if you don't press shift on the keyboard and just do this the text scales uniformly so again let's use the shift key click this check button to accept the transformations that we have just made and exit quick mass mode by pressing Q on the keyboard finally press this button to create the mass create a blank image and we'll just drag this the image that we have just created or to the new image let's crop this one just press C and click this check button let's create a drop shadow just adjust these parameters and click ok thank you guys for watching and uh, sa mga hindi pa subscribe sa channel na ito, please subscribe and support this channel para lumago naman siya at sa pag subscribe niyo wag niyong kalimutan i-click yung notification bell para updated kayo sa mga latest uploads na channel na ito so thank you sa lahat mabuhay ang mga Pinoy visualizers